let x be an integer. In this problem, we're going to prove that if x is even, then x squared is congruent to 0 modulo 4. So let me refresh your memory on exactly um, what everything means here. So z here is the set of integers. x being an even number means we can write x in the form 2 times n, where n is an integer. That's what it means uh, for an integer to be even. And more importantly, what does uh, this congruence mean? So we say that A is congruent to B uh, modulo N. And the way I like to interpret this is to say that this is the same as saying A minus B is a multiple of N. Multiple of N. And so what does that mean? That basically means A minus B is equal to... Um, k times n for some integer k, so for some k and z. So it's just easier for me to think of it this way uh, in terms of, it's the same thing as saying it's divisible by n, um, but I like to use the word multiple. It's just easier to do the proofs, for me at least. So that's what we have to show in this problem. So proof, let's try it. I actually have not done this problem, so this will be kind of interesting. So this is an if-then statement, so we have to start by assuming um, that x is even. That's the if part. So suppose x is even. And now we have to show that x squared is congruent to 0 modulo 4. So before we do that, we should probably use the fact uh, that x is even. So what does that mean? So this means... that x is equal to 2 times n for some integer n, so for some n in the set of integers. So now we've pretty much exhausted what we have uh, with our hypothesis. So let's go ahead and try to show that uh, x squared is congruent to 0 modulo 4. So in order to do that, we'll show that x squared minus 0 is a multiple of 4, right, because that's what it would mean. See here it says a minus b is a multiple of n. So here it would mean x squared minus 0 is a multiple of 4. So let's write down x squared minus 0. So then x squared minus 0. Well, what is that? Well, that's equal to 2n squared minus 0, which is just 2n squared. I'm showing lots of extra steps here, which is just 4n squared which is a multiple of 4, which is a multiple of 4 since it's 4 times an integer. So since n squared is actually an integer because n is an integer. So, so we have 4 times an integer. So x squared minus 0 is 4 times an integer. So that means it's a multiple of 4. So this means... x squared is congruent to 0 modulo 4. And that completes our congruence proof. So a really simple proof, but it really does require uh, that you end, understand the proof structure and what it means. What, what, what does it mean? What does this congruence uh, actually mean? I hope this video has been helpful.